outside of the NOC. We made it to Gatlinburg. Tourist trap of Tennessee. <laughs> when in Gatlinburg, what is this called? The Gatlinburg Skywalk. The Gatlinburg Skywalk, nice. <laughs> We just met Bad Weather working here at the Skyride and like a true trail brother he was, he hooked us up with some free pizza. So thank you to Bad Weather, thank you for the trail magic. The trail provides. When we come into town, this is what it looks like. We unpack the bag, lay out everything, throw away all of the trash, get rid of things we haven't used in quite a while because we clearly don't need them. <sighs> Recharge and get organized. Good morning, everybody. It's uh, my zero day here in Gatlinburg. Taking care of some chores. Gonna get some laundry done and stop at the pancake house, get some breakfast with Lucky and his wife, Missy. That'll be a lot of fun. Hey guys, uh, gonna stop at the Walgreens here in Gatlinburg, resupply on some food and things I need for the trail. I didn't want to film too much here in Gatlinburg because this isn't why I'm on the AT. I'm on the AT, AT to do some hiking, so um, had some good food while I was here, you know. Definitely really great people watching. Oh my god. Although I guess I'm getting some looks because of my dirty clothes, dirty feet, sandals, and whatnot, but whatever. <laughs> so, I'm gonna stop at Walgreens, um, wrap it up, and then I decided not to double zero, like I said. I'm gonna jump back on the trail in the morning and stick with Lucky for a little while longer. He's a good dude. You know, I wanna keep the tramway alive for as long as I can. Got my resupply, Walgreens, it's been about $45. Also picked up a super small detangling hairbrush, so that is great. Um, so my understanding of Gatlinburg is that there's a lot of like attractions that nobody actually wants to do, and a lot of restaurants and like novelty bars that nobody actually wants to go to. And there's like a million people driving around really nice cars and going really, really fast. But I feel like I see the same cars and they're just honestly doing laps to try and get attention. It's very interesting. Gatlinburg is a very unique city. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about that. I'm gonna go to bed and we're gonna resume the hike tomorrow. One zero day, not two. Ready to get back on trail. sign that makes it official. Tennessee state line. Ah, getting ready to hit the trail again. Good morning everybody. It is day. Uh, what is today? Today is the 27th. So it's day 16, 15 for 18 miles. Just got back to Newfound Gap about 845 and jumped on the trail. And it was about 20 degrees this morning at Newfound Gap with very high winds. So we're all bundled up, but the sun is shining and the trail has a few small little spots of ice. But other than that, it's completely dry. So that's a good thing. Uh, we're ready to crush the Smokies today and tomorrow and get out of them. We are officially in Tennessee. You saw the state line sign finally. Um, but we're still straddling it, I think. <sighs> but yeah, we're ready to 
keep on moving. I believe our next uh, stop off trail will be in, I guess it's not off trail, but uh, Hot Springs, North Carolina. Here we go. Bunyan, but there's a little side trail right next to it that goes above it. Let's take a look.
I don't know, mass hole with a saw is kind of a frightening concept. <laughs> oh man. Now throw it rock on. And he signed this, like he started, I didn't know, I thought he was running maybe from Newfound out in the back, no, like he's doing miles. Yeah, yeah. He, he, he told me he'd come up Cosby. Yeah, he marked his yeah, car. He, he, he signed this today and said, I'm doing the running thing today. Right back his wow. car. He did all this in one day. Yeah, yeah. yeah he had he long had a, hair, his big mustache. Off, he had spring I must have been day. so exhausted and cold because I didn't even notice he did this missing one. Good morning, everybody. I don't know what day it is, but it'll probably say so in the corner once the video is up. But um, uh, yesterday was my absolute favorite part of the AT so far. Um, the stretch from Newfound Gap, 15 miles to 15 or 16 or so, to, uh, man, I'm really bad at knowing the names of these shelters. Um, either way, the trail was just beautiful. It was the most beautiful part of the Smokies. Got to experience Charlie's Bunyan, which, oh my God, the view. Oh God, almost died. If you, uh, if you are ever in the Smokies, I would suggest going to Newfound Gap and hiking the three and change miles to Charlie's Bunyan because the view is absolutely worth it. Just remember to pack out anything you bring with you. Um, last night at the shelter as well was awesome. We built a big fire because last night was probably the coldest night I've experienced so far in the AT besides that first night. Um, I was warm, but it just it just was very cold outside. Um, my water filter also froze because I forgot to put it in my sleeping bag. Had it right next to me, just forgot to pop it in with my body heat. So might need to get a new one of those. No, there were a lot of cool people at the shelter. Um, about six or seven of us kind of stayed up late with the fire and we were just hooting and hollering. It was a great time. Uh, a dude I've kind of been hiking on and off with on occasion. I wouldn't call him part of the tram yet because we're going at our own pace. We just keep running into each other as mass hole. That dude is hilarious. Like, literally so funny. And he's like a through hiker extraordinaire. He's giving me a lot of really good advice. So that's been awesome. But yeah, a lot of really cool people at the shelter last night. And it was just a good time. I don't really film too much of the shelters because, you know, I don't want to invade people's personal space. And I feel a little awkward saying, hey, you guys mind if I film? Like, I'm not one of those people. I'm filming this for me, so. That's why there's not a lot of other people typically when I film. So if you were wondering why, that'd be the reason. Maybe one of these times I'll pluck up the courage to say, hey, do you guys care if I film while we're just hanging out? But it is what it is. Like I said, it's been a great stretch. The trail has been great. Um, not too strenuous, but still a nice challenge. The forest is beautiful. As you can see, we're just walking through this dense pine forest right now and I love it. Ah, oh, man, this has been a great finish to the Smokies, despite the fact that it is very cold outside. All right, I'll check y'all later. Mountain permits, and we're 
crossing Davenport Gap, officially done with the Smokies. Tell me. 